These ads belong to a company that did over $2 million in revenue just last month. What's crazy is that none of these were filmed by real creators. Every single one was generated with AI. And while most brands are still paying UGC creators hundreds and sometimes even over $1,000 for a single video, these ads are made in minutes, cost a fraction of that, and are ready to post immediately. That's why so many brand owners are quietly switching over. Because traditional UGC is slow and expensive. If a creator turns in a bad video, your only option is to fix it, which takes a lot of time. But with AI UGC, you can test dozens of variations fast, get consistent quality, and scale campaigns without waiting weeks for content. And in this video, I'll show you step by step how to create these viral AI TikTok ads using Arcad's AI. So you can finally run ads that bring money in instead of wasting it. So the tool we're going to be using to create these AI UGC ads is called Arcad's, and honestly, right now is the best tool out there for this. So let me quickly show you what it looks like. When you first open it up, you'll get this menu right here. And the first thing you'll wanna do is create a new project by clicking here. That takes you straight into the main workflow. Now inside the workflow, you've got this prompting section. This is where you actually put in your script. And in just a couple of minutes, I'm gonna show you the exact framework I've found that works best for creating AI UGC scripts. Then you've got all these different generation options. For example, you can even show your own app inside the video or create a POV of yourself unboxing a product. And that's really useful because it makes the ad feel native to TikTok. Like the kind of content people are already watching instead of something that feels like a generic ad. Now moving on to the generators, the one we're going to be using is called OmniHuman. And the reason for that is simple. It adds emotions to the voice. So instead of the delivery sounding flat, it feels much more natural and realistic, which is what makes people actually stop scrolling and pay attention. You also get to choose how you want the voice to be generated. You can either go with text to speech or speech to speech, depending on what you're going for. And then finally, you have the option to add actors into the video. So the product I decided to make my UGC ad about is this face roller I found online. It's actually a pretty viral tool that's been sold for a while now. So I figured it would be a good example. With that in mind, let's go ahead and select the actor that's going to fit this type of product. When you first go into the add actors section, you can sort between different options. In my case, I'll go with female and then probably narrow it down to young adult. After that, I like to sort them by newly added, just so I know I'm always getting the freshest actors since Arcad is adding new ones all the time. And as you can see, that already narrows it down pretty accurately. But just to mention this, you can also sort your actors by different situations. You've got a lot of categories here, things like accessories, emotions, and even skin tones. So you can target different demographics depending on what you're promoting. Now, out of the actors available here, I like Ramira and Amy as well. So I'm gonna select both of them. And yes, you can actually select a ton of different actors at the same time. Honestly, I've never even hit the limit. You could probably go with 10 or more generators running at once if you wanted to. For this example though, we'll just stick with two. So I'll click add actors and now it's time to actually write our script. The easiest formula I've found for writing my UGC scripts is to start with a hook, something that grabs attention right away, either by calling out a pain point, a feeling, or just anything that really resonates with the audience. From there, I go into the problem, so basically explaining what the issue is that the product is going to solve. Then I jump straight into the solution. And finally, I wrap it up with a clear call to action, telling them to go check out or buy the product. So the script I'm going with for this example looks like this. It starts off in a very relatable way. It's got more of a girly vibe to it, something that will immediately feel natural to the person watching. And that's intentional because I don't want it to look like an ad at all. I want it to feel just like a regular video, something someone might actually post on TikTok. So it blends right in with the content they're already watching. Then after that, it moves into the problem. In this case, it's talking about how her face always looks puffy in the morning when she wakes up. I also added in that kind of blah motion, which I think will come out really well and make it more believable. From there, it transitions into the solution. She uses this tool from a website called Timo. And after using it, her face looks so much fresher. Finally, she closes it out by pointing out that it's actually really cheap and that people can grab it themselves by clicking the link in the description. Now, the coolest feature when writing your script inside Arcads is this button right here that says add speech emotion. When I click it, you can see it adds commands for how the actor is going to say different lines in the text. And the nice thing is you can place these emotions in between lines. So the delivery changes throughout the script instead of sounding flat the whole way through. You can also completely change them up. For example, I'll remove this last one and switch it to cheerfully because I want the final line to feel really upbeat. That way it ends on a happy, positive note when she's calling someone to buy, which in return gives us much better results. So now that the script is done, let's go even further and fine tune the voice. You do that by clicking the little settings icon next to each character. And from there, you can adjust how they sound. I'll start with Amy. First, let's listen to her default voice before we make any changes. If you haven't tried jade rollers, like what are you even doing? 
I swear, every morning I wake up looking puffy and just feeling kind of blah. Honestly, it sounds pretty solid already, but for me, it feels a little bit too slow. Not really the vibe I'm going for. So the first adjustment I'll make is increasing the speed so her delivery feels quicker and more natural. Next, I'm going to lower the stability setting. Stability basically controls how consistent the voice is across the lines. If it's too high, it can sound a little monotone, so I'll get it down to 0.3. Then we have similarity, which adjusts how closely the delivery matches the script and punctuation. I'll bring this down a bit too, just so her voice has a little more variation and play in it. And finally, style exaggeration. This one boosts things like intonation, emotion, and emphasis. Exactly what we need here to make the delivery pop. I'll raise this pretty significantly up to 0.4. Now let's listen back to the result. If you haven't tried Jade Rollers, like, what are you even doing? I swear, every morning I wake up looking puffy and just feeling kinda blah. And you can hear the difference instantly. It makes the entire script sound so much more alive. Here's a pro tip. Always listen to your audio before you generate the final ad. You don't want to waste time creating something that ends up unusable. The pre-listen feature lets you nail down the exact sound you want without generating anything yet. So now I'll tweak the settings for Ramira as well, just to make sure her voice matches the vibe we're going for. And once that's done, we can hit generate and take a look at the final videos we get back. And now, just a couple of minutes later, our results are finally ready. So let's take a look at both of them. Starting with Amy. If you haven't tried jade rollers, like what are you even doing? I swear, every morning I wake up looking puffy and just feeling kind of blah. But when I use this jade roller and gua sha from Timu, it makes my face feel so much fresher. Like I actually slept. It's super cheap and you can find it right now if you click the link in the description. Go grab it before they sell out. The video came out really quick. And what's cool here is you can actually see one of the newest features of their latest generator. It doesn't just add emotions to the voice, it also adds physical emotions to the character. Overall, I'd say the video looks really good, very accurate, and pretty natural. Now the second one, in my opinion, came out even better in some ways. If you haven't tried jade rollers, like what are you even doing? I swear, every morning I wake up looking puffy and just feeling kind of blah. But when I use this jade roller and gua sha from Timu, it makes my face feel so much fresher like I actually slept. It's super cheap and you can find it right now if you click the link in the description. Go grab it before they sell out. I actually liked her delivery a lot more, and that's mostly thanks to the settings we tweaked earlier. So now that we basically have our ad ready to go, there's one more thing I really wanted to add for this specific example, an unboxing shot of the product. To do that, you'd select a feature called Unboxing POV. Then you just drag and drop a picture of your product. For me, I simply grabbed a screenshot from the website where I found the face roller, and then I chose a template. Since this is a bathroom product, I picked the sync template, which felt like the best fit. I click generate, and honestly, the the result came out looking very good. For a quick clip inside your ad, it adds a lot of realism and makes the product feel way more believable. I also loved how the box itself looked. It even created separate cutouts for each product inside, which looked super natural. Definitely a solid generation. Before we move into the final step of creating the ad, I want to quickly show you another feature I really like, which is the show your app option. This one is very useful if you're promoting some kind of digital software. All you have to do is upload a screenshot of your app. I uploaded this picture right here, then selected my actor. You don't have as many options here as with the regular actors, since not all of them are holding a phone, but there's still more than enough to fit your brand. Luckily for me, Amy was available in this list too, so I selected her and hit generate, and the result turned out looking really cool. One of my favorite things about this feature is that since it's made with a green screen style overlay on the phone, you actually get reflections and natural hand movements over the screen. Those little details add so much realism and make the ad look way better. So now that we've got all of our assets generated, the last step is to bring them together. I'll head over to CapCut, drop everything in, here's the final result. If you haven't tried jade rollers, like what are you even doing? I swear, every morning I wake up looking puffy and just feeling kinda blah. But when I use this jade roller and gua sha from Timu, it makes my face feel so much fresher, like I actually slept. It's super cheap and you can find it right now if you click the link in the description. Go grab it before they sell out. And as you can see, the ad came out looking really realistic. I even added captions, which always help with conversions, because people scroll with sound off half the time. And honestly, this doesn't look like an AI ad at all. It just looks like a normal TikTok video of someone casually recommending a product they like. That's exactly the point. And it really shows how well Arcads makes these AI UGC ads and how quickly you can put one together from start to finish. So as you just saw, Arcads makes UGC ads that look incredible. You can build a fully done ad in minutes, and it feels just like a normal video someone would post themselves. 
That's what makes it so powerful, because instead of spending hundreds of dollars and waiting weeks for a creator to deliver, you can start testing ads today. With Arc Ads, you're not locked into one idea. You can do tons of different ads with different scripts, actors, and emotions all in a matter of seconds. Then you just run them, see which angle actually works best, and scale from there. And here's the thing, even if you're someone who still prefers to use traditional UGC with real creators, Arcad still saves you a ton of time and money because you can test every idea with AI first. Once you know the exact hook and angle that's converting, that's when you bring in a real creator to film that one ad. And at that point, you already know it's gonna hit. So whether you're running everything with AI or just using it as a testing machine before you bring in real actors, Arcad's is honestly the best way right now to create TikTok ads that actually sell. If you wanna try for yourself, I've linked Arcad's down in the description go check it out and start making your own AI UGC ads today. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.